everyone, my name is Madison Taylor and in this video today I'm going to be showing you everything I bought that has that kind of crochet material which is really great for summer. So one thing I really want to do is I looked online on Pinterest and Instagram and looked up that kind of music festival crochet outfits, really bright colors, really bright for summer. Um, and I wanted to kind of just give you guys a haul of everything I bought. I am going to music festival in a couple weeks, so I thought these clothes would be perfect for something, you know, that can sit on the beach. And if they get ruined, it's, you know, not going to cost me $200 or so. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get into the video. So to go ahead and preface this video, I just want to let you guys know that the, none of these clothes are sponsored. I did go ahead and purchase all these clothes with my own money. I did buy all these clothes from Shein, which I know to some of you might be a controversial opinion. The reason I honestly decided to buy from Shein versus, you know, another website like Etsy or Nancy Gal or maybe a little bit better quality is, I'll be very honest with you, I wanted something that's not going to cost me an arm and a leg because I am going to a music festival which doesn't involve me sitting on grass, on sand, potentially the clothes could get ruined. I didn't want to spend a couple hundred dollars on the top or a bottom that I could potentially ruin in some aspects. Um, if you've been to a music festival, you know it's not, you know, the cleanest of places, it's dirty, you know, you get sweaty out. So if these clothes do end up being ruined, I don't, I, you know, I'm not out of pocket $200. Um, again, I fully understand that Shein, I don't regularly shop on Shein whatsoever. And <laughs> it's just on this occasion, I wanted something that's, you know, a little bit cheaper that if I ruined, again, I didn't spend $200 on. So not condoning Shein or the practices of fast fashion. However, I just want to let you guys know that this is where the clothes are purchased from. I'm going to be doing a before and after. So what the clothes look like on me and what they look like on the model online. So without further ado, let's go ahead and show you the first outfit. Now for this first outfit here, this is a two-piece set. One comes with a long skirt and the other is the top. One thing I want to note about all these pieces is they are extremely uh, see-through, seeing that they are that kind of crochet material. So I just had to put a, basically a pair of nude shorts underneath. Depending on where you're going, if you're wearing them out or you're going to the beach, you might decide to throw a bathing suit underneath. So I just have a pair of nude shorts on underneath. Um, one thing I did with this outfit, well, I would probably not necessarily wear this to the beach just because of the skirt, but maybe if you're going out to dinner or something outdoors, it's kind of more summery. Um, that's kind of where I would wear this with. So I paired it with my wooden bag over here and um, just some gold jewelry to kind of tie it all together. But one thing I do like about this, it is very summery. It's very breezy. So if it's extremely hot out, you know, this is a really great outfit. And the one thing also I do like, again, about this is a two piece. So you can wear the, you know, the skirt separately or the top separately if you want to with, wear it with shorts. That's probably what I would do, just a white pair of shorts. But again, this is the full outfit of the first one that I bought um, for the crochet look. So again, I want to come over in my mirror over here and just show you the full outfit on my camera, which I just use my iPhone so you can kind of see a better look. But again, you can see the full outfit. This is the top, which you can kind of see a little bit better. Again, I would pair it with some shorts and some, just either a nude, nude bra or pasties that I use underneath. And this is a skirt. It is a pretty full length skirt. And I just paired it with these Free People sandals that I had on. Again, you can see the full look from head to toe, but um, again, one thing I do like about it, it is a two piece, so you can wear it with, you know, some different outfit combinations. If it's a short or you can wear the skirt separately, but again, this is the full outfit. So over here I have outfit number two, and this is actually a two piece set, although it kind of looks like one. So it is this fringy top and on bottom we have the shorts. So again, I want to again preface everything. This is very see-through. I did have to wear some nude shorts underneath, but this would be perfect if you want to pair with a bathing suit or kind of, um, you know, anything else if you're going to the beach. This is probably what I'm going to honestly end up wearing to the music festival. I want to get something that was fringy and really light because it is going to be very hot at the music festival down in Florida in the middle of summer. So um, one thing about this I would say is it is a pain to wash, mainly because of the fringes at the bottom. I did throw this in my washer and didn't put in the dryer, but just to detangle all this was quite a pain. So I will say it's pretty true to size. Everything I've gotten in a small, but it's pretty true to size. Nothing seems overly big or overly tight. And I would say quality wise is actually, you know, pretty nice for buying it for under $20. So again, I would 
probably buy this piece again if you're going to a music festival or somewhere that you want a little bit of color, a little bit of fun, but I think it's a pretty cute outfit. But this is the front, and so you can see the back over here. Um, overall, this is probably one of my favorite ones I bought from the haul today. This is just so you can see the full outfit, but you can go ahead and see the fringe and then these shorts down below. Honestly, you can't really tell they're shorts because of the fringe that comes in, you know, on top over here. It kind of just looks like one piece, but you can kind of see a little bit better. I just paired it with same thing, gold jewelry and uh, the Free People shoes to keep it consistent so we can just kind of look at the details but I don't see any you know big ripping or anything wrong with the crochet of how it came in in terms of the quality but um again front and the back pretty cute um good price point you know under 25 bucks so I would probably recommend this one to anyone that's looking to purchase something fun for the summer so next up we have this blue and white striped dress. So one thing I will note just right off the bat is this is incredibly short, especially on the description online. After the reviews I read, some say it was short, some say it was okay length, but how it was advertised is that it kind of came down to your mid calf, knee area, but that is definitely not the case. I probably personally just wouldn't recommend this unless I was wearing a bathing suit or something underneath. It's just too short for me. I think I'm just gonna save it and use it as a beach cover up. What you can see on the length here, it is incredibly short. Like if you bend over, pretty much everything is going to be showing. So you can see the front and the back. Um, again, if you like something that that is that short, by all means, go ahead and purchase it. But just me, I wouldn't feel comfortable enough without wearing something, you know, like a bathing suit underneath. But for $10 or, you know, $12, um, it is incredibly good quality for what it is. I didn't see anything ripping or the crochet material coming off. And it's a cute summer dress overall. It's breezy, it's light. And again, if you're going to the beach, this is probably the perfect thing to wear. Again, we're coming over to my mirror so you can see the look. I do like this kind of keyhole detail that it has on it and the crochet materials. I have my shorts on underneath, but you can kind of see from the length here, it is so short. I wish it was just a tad longer down to my fingers. It would have definitely been a great outfit to wear. It has on the details on the back, you can't really see it on my mirror, but it has this cross detail um, that you can wear it with. I'm probably, again, just gonna save this for a beach cover up because of the length of it. But if you like short dresses, by all means, this is probably a way to go for the summer. So for my next outfit here, I did want to say that I actually forgot to buy the top with this. It was my mistake. I didn't fully read the description well enough. Um, it was kind of, to me anyway, I was reading it. I thought it was a two-piece set, but when I actually went and purchased it over the package, it just came with a skirt. And upon further looking at the description, it said skirt only. So I actually had to rebuy the top and I'm waiting for it to come in. So please excuse the uncoordinating top and the bottom. I just paired it with the previous top I had on, but I just wanted to show you guys the skirt and the pattern. Um, what they did really do like about this is the fringe. I mean, the fringe, I feel like the same thing with the other items, pretty good quality, um, quality of this. It's nice, it's breezy. I like the color scheme. And again, it's a really good outfit for the summer. And although I don't have the matching top, you can kind of see the gist of everything. I'll put a picture above so you can see, you know, what the full outfit was exactly supposed to look like. But again, it's cute. It's comfortable. This is the back over here so you can see. The top's going to be relatively similar to this, but in the same pattern. Uh, but again, cute, easy, you know, throw on during the summer. Really comfortable. And especially if you're going to a festival or something you know, that you want a bright color for, this would be a great outfit to wear. So for my next outfit, this is a two-piece. It is a short and a top. One thing I want to note compared to the other shorts is these are very see-through. There's basically pretty big chunks of holes in it. I do have some nor um, nude spanks on underneath so you can take a look and see. But um, this is what I was kind of wearing to maybe day two festival. It's on the beach again. It's going to be hot out. You want something light and breezy. But overall, I think it's you know, pretty cute. It definitely has that festival attire. And one thing I do like about this is you can wear the top and the bottom separately if you want to pair the top with, you know, some other shorts or something else. Um, but you can see this is the front and this is the back of it. Um, depending on the shorts, they might tuck out. Sometimes mine tend to tuck out as well. But overall, I think it's pretty cute quality of it. I think the shorts were like five bucks. The, ten, the top was 
under 10. So again, quality of it, can't really complain for the price that you're paying. But when it came in, I don't see any rips or tears or anything. So for that factor, I have to give it a thumbs up on my end. And I really do like the color scheme of the bright colors that it is using. So over here, I wanted to show you the top again. It's the crochet material. This top actually is pretty thick um, comparative to where your front is going to be. It's just the shorts, they are incredibly sheer. So you can, put, you can see my shorts below, but you can see the crochet material very thin if you're going to wear a cover-up maybe this is a good idea but you can see the front and somewhat of the back as well so while i'm over here i just want to show you another way i would probably wear this without the bottoms i just paired the top on over here with my lucky brand white shorts again this is probably better suited if you're going somewhere warm if you're going on vacation or somewhere more tropical music festival again great um, price place to wear but you can see the full outfit but again just with the white shorts which could be another great option to wear this top with. Thank you for everyone for watching. Once again, my name is Madison Taylor, and I really do appreciate you coming to this video and checking it out. If you do like any of the products I wore today, I'm going to link them down in the description. Again, this video isn't sponsored or anything, but if you do like anything, might as well share it with you guys and know where to buy it from. So I'm going to try to make this video series, if you would, into a weekly video where we're talking about a different fashion item or something that's just relevant in business or, you know, whatever it might be. Um, on the topic of discussion. So again, if you like this video, give it a big thumbs up, subscribe to the channel, and we will see you guys in the next video. Thank you so much for watching. We'll see you soon.